Ouse is Lendl Bridge, right in the centre of York, with the river ooze flowing below it. We know that Megan Roberts' friends were picked up on CCTV in the early hours of Thursday morning on the other side of that bridge. She was with them as they went over the bridge just before, but she wasn't with them afterwards. So investigations do appear to be focusing at the moment on the river here with specialist search teams. Superintendent Phil Kane is from North Yorkshire Police. He's with me here this afternoon. Just tell us a little bit about the exact details of when Megan was last seen and, and, and when she didn't then appear on camera. Yeah, absolutely. It's on the Wednesday night. Megan has gone out with some of her friends um, into the city centre of York. In the early hours of the Thursday morning, Megan's uh, friends have last seen her in Pop World on George Hudson Street. Uh, CCTV shows Megan leaving Pop World around 0 to 10 hours in the morning with one of her friends. Um, we then see Megan on CCTV with some other friends from York University at the, at the bottom of Lendl Bridge around 2.20 a.m. This is just outside the Maltins public house. Her friends are then picked up on the other side of Lendl Bridge shortly after, but Megan isn't with them at that time. And it, it is from that point, really, that we're appealing to the public to assist us with any inquiries or sightings or information they have about Megan's movements following that time. And one of the obvious lines of inquiry then is that she's somehow ended up in the it, it, it falling into the water. Would that be fair to say? Yeah, it is. You know, we're obviously increasingly concerned for Megan's safety and her welfare. But the close proximity to the river always leads us in, in searches of this type to to, to discount that, and, and that's what this we're doing at this moment of time. It's one of the main searches that we're doing. Some people might think, oh, she might have just broken away from a group of friends and taken a different route. Have you checked CCTV on other routes she could have taken home that night? Yeah, absolutely. Again, we're checking CCTV uh, throughout the rest of that time. There are certain routes where we have discounted, so we know that Megan hasn't gone along Lehman Road. She hasn't gone over Lendl Bridge and taken her usual route home along Bootham and Exhibition Square. Uh, so these are the lines of inquiry. For, you know, hopefully Megan has gone somewhere with someone, is out there safe and well, and just not aware of the concern that's being raised for her. Is this a criminal investigation at this stage or a, a missing persons inquiry? At this moment in time, it is not a criminal investigation. It is focused on a missing persons inquiry.